What's up, YouTube? OG J5 about to hit you again with another video. Okay, cool. Uh, Fannie Willis didn't struck again. Fannie Willis, the uh, district attorney down in Fulton County in Atlanta, has struck again with another RICO charge. She has rounded up 26 members of the Drug Rich Gang or the RX Gang. Um, she's not playing. Fannie Willis is down there not playing. She already got thug uh, tied up in the Rico, even got Gunner tied up in the Rico. She said out her mouth in that interview that she said that the last gang member that she uh, convicted, that she prosecuted, that, that he got life without parole plus 15 years. And the, and the cold part about it was that lady was up there smiling the whole time. She's up there just cheesy. Yeah, you got another Rico job. Uh, we got 26 of them. I believe, I forget the exact number. <laughs> I forget the exact number. I believe it was about 18 of them. Five is in the wind. But we're going to go get them uh, for the, for, I'm using slang terms right now. That's what she said. She said, I'm using slang terms right now for the work that they put in. She said, of uh, the, the crimes, I should say. She is not playing with y'all. And she said she do not care nothing about uh, y'all talking about she targeting rappers and using their lyrics against her. She said if you commit crimes and then you want to go confess over a beat, <laughs> then she would lock your funky ass up for it and prosecute you for that. She would take that as a confession. She even read one of the rap lyrics that she going to use on the drug rich gang. She said they is accused of, of, of kicking in doors, of committing robberies and kidnappings and uh, this, that, whoop the bop the bell. And she said, then she ran off a rap lyric. She said, well, they they out there doing it and then they rapping about it. That's evidence. So it, it, maybe you shouldn't rap about it over a beat. And she said, don't rap about it in my county. She said, don't bring that shit down to my county. So let's get to this news article. 26 alleged gang members indicted after a series of crimes against ATL celebrities. 26 people arrested in connection to gang-related activity in Metro Atlanta. Many incidents are connected to the well-known celebs in the city, according to Fulton District of County Monday, today. August, uh, I believe it was August 29th, pretty sure, 23rd or 29th. But yeah, I'm doing, she said, they, they said in the article, 26 people arrested, but I think it was 26 people indicted. And I think she said um, in the uh, in the, in the the news report or whatever you call it, or interview or whatever uh, like that, that, that she's locked up 18, five is on the run. And I guess the other three is, I don't know, maybe they're making plans to uh, turn themselves in. But Fanny uh, said she's coming to get you. She, she didn't say she collaborated with everybody but the Secret Service. She said she collaborated with the U.S. Marshals. She collaborated with the U.S. The, the U.S. Attorneys. She collaborated with uh, di different uh, jurisdictions. She collaborated with Silver Springs. That's down in Stone Mountain, Atlanta. She's collaborating with everybody to put gang members behind bars for committing crimes. So let's continue on with this article. Uh, DA Fannie Willis and this announced they are formally bringing RICO charges against the drug rich gang. Um, and I quote, she says, if you thought Fulton was a good county to bring your crime to, to bring your violence to, you are wrong and you are going to suffer consequences. And today is the start of some of those consequences. Fannie Willis is one cold piece. She is not playing. And she also said that she's only uh she's only done with 60% of the indictments that she has planned on. She she got she still got nearly half of the Ricos and the indictments that she want to pop up with her. She got a special grand jury down there. They got she got a special grand jury. I don't know what a grand jury is, but I don't know what a special grand jury is. But I don't know. I don't want no, I don't want my name coming across none of their desk. I know that for sure. Let's continue on. Excuse me with this article. All right. The office said the gang targeted and tracked those who flaunt their wealth on social media. So apparently she's saying that the uh that this this alleged gang members were targeting people uh stunning or flaunting their wealth on social media like Instagram and Facebook and and uh maybe Twitter and uh, maybe even their YouTubes. I'm not sure exactly the, the social media profiles, but some of these celebrities, I see it was an NFL, uh, an Atlanta Falcons player. They robbing soccer players, uh, reality TV stars. They didn't even got a future, one of the future baby mamas. They didn't caught her slipping on the ground, but they did her something. Yeah, so let's continue on. Uh, it was 16 incidences, uh, no murders. Nobody was even killed. She talking about giving you life and some. Life with an L. 
uh, no murders, but kidnapping, robbing, uh, shootings, and home invasions. And it even had one incident of a 16 year old female uh, being uh, in the shower at the time and they forced her down in the basement, I guess. And uh, luckily, uh, no major harm was brought to her. But yeah, I had to break that news, man. Like, uh, and I think she's not done. I think Fannie Will is gonna say the best for last. That's what I think, because she is enjoying this. That lady is up there having a great day. She even said, she said, I had a great day, I had a great day. And then I guess something else uh, happened to, uh, <clears throat> I guess it was an incident of domestic violence down there. When I don't know if, I don't know if somebody passed away, but I know it's definitely incidents of domestic violence that she said over the weekend. And I would hate to be that guy, because she about to knock sparks off your behind, brother man. She about to knock sparks, you can see it. She enjoys putting a nigga behind bars. She enjoys it. I don't think I'm not I'm not gonna dig into I didn't dig into her background, nothing like that. But I pay close attention to close details. And I don't think she married. I don't think she married. So she probably man, I'm I don't I don't that's just a, a, an observation that I made. But it's it's one thing for sure, two things for certain. She is not playing. She's coming down there to make uh she's coming down here to make her uh, presence felt. And she is Atlanta's first. I don't want to say that she was the first black woman, but she's definitely the first female. That's a stone cold fact. So yeah, uh, 26 members of the of the drug the the drug gang, uh, the, the 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 rich drug rich gang. I mean, that own type of gang, and they supposed to be a mix of GDs and Bloods. And so she does. She says take that shit to another county. So I don't know what y'all got going on down there in Atlanta, but clean it up, man, because Fannie Willis is not playing. Fannie Willis is coming to knock off heads. So yeah, that's my block for the day. Fannie Willis has struck again with a smile. She didn't indict 26 alleged gang members with a smile on her face. She just cheesed so hard. Yeah, you, she told me, well, you right, you, you come on over, over here. Yeah, you, 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 you stand right here. Everybody come together now. She said, come together like y'all act, act like you like each other now. <laughs> she is not playing. She's kicking ass and taking names. And so, yeah, she didn't indict 26 more guys on the RICO charge. And she said she liked RICO charges. Yeah, she said she liked RICOs. So she liked Rico charges. She said the jury feel like uh she feels like the jury want to know the whole story and they real intelligent and man. So Fannie Willis is not playing. She's trying to give out L's. You know what that means. So hey, everybody. Uh, hope everybody had a good weekend. Back on the grind Monday. Hey, big homie J Fifth. I'm gone.